In these last few videos, we're going to be talking about some other very useful functions in Google Sheets. So let's think about what is the purpose of Google Sheets. What it, what are we what are we trying to use it for? Well, we're trying to make it do the work for us to go through a lot of those monotonous processes and actually do the work for us. And one of those functions is the split function. So if we want to, or if we have, for example, a set of data that we want to split up, uh, maybe it's somebody's typing in their name, first and last name, into one column and we want to split up into two columns, we can actually use this split function. So let's see how it works. So we're going to say equals split, and then it brings up this, um, or the information on the split. So it's asking what is the text and what is that delimitator? So a delimitator is that particular uh, aspect that we want to split it up by. That's the separator. So let's see how this works. Our text is our names. So I want to split that text. And I want to split it into first and last name. So I want to split it by this space. So we need to put this in parentheses or in a quotations. We're going to put a space in quotations. So we're going to split this by that particular space. So whatever this delimitator is, is what you want it split by. I'm going to close my parentheses. And it's you can see it splits my name into first and last name. And I can drag that down. And just like that, if somebody, if, uh, you have a, a list of first and last names and you want them split up, you can split them that easily. Now, what if we have, uh, we, we're downloading um, a set of information and it's all separated out by these semicolons. So maybe we go and we download some information off the internet or some data off the, in off the internet and it's comma separated values. You might see that where everything uh, is separated by a comma. Well, how can we split all this up without having to copy and paste and cut and, and retype and things like that? Well, we can use this split function. So here we have some data that was all in, um, that was separated by semicolons, but whenever I copied and pasted it in, it copied and pasted it directly as one, one column type deal or one thing, and I need to separate it out now um, by those semicolons. So what I can do is I can say equals split, and there's my text, and I want to separate it by these semicolons. So I'm going to use comma, my delimitator, it's got to be in quotations, is a semicolon. And I press enter. And it's going to split it out by every semicolon that it sees. And I can now drag this down. And boom, I have just now separated all these out. Now, what if I want to take it one step further? What if I want, I've got tag and breed here, but maybe I want to separate tag from breed and then still keep all of this data the same. Well, how can I do that? Well, let's come down here. And I'm actually going to use a split function again. And I'm going to su split this information. But you can see there's a space in between the number and the breed. So I'm actually going to split this value right here by a space. And then I can just drag that down. Now, what do I do over here? Because I can't really say split anymore, but I want to get this same information down here. Well, that's relatively simple. We're just going to use direct cell referencing. We're going to say that this one equals this G3, that the pasture, uh, pasture 2 equals that one. It asked me, do I want to autofill? Well, I'm not going to go ahead and I'm not going to autofill it yet. But because I did a simple cell referencing, I can take my mouse, put it in the lower right hand corner, drag over and then drag down. And just like that, I have now separated out the uh, the tag number from the breed, from the pasture, from whether or not they were bred or open, and then the cow age in all of these. Now, what about in a hog operation? Maybe you were typing in hog notching uh, information and all the information is given to you like this, where it has litter number and then the, um, the actual pig number and it's separated by a dash or a, a hyphen on each one of these. We can do the same exact process by saying equals split. And it's trying to guess it here, but we're gonna split this, um, we're, gonna, we're gonna split this cell, this text, 
And our delimiter is going to be this dash. Close off our parentheses, press enter. We can drag this down. And now we have uh, effectively separated that litter number from that pig number on each and every single one of these.